good boy, my nigga. Good dog. I think I might should go change my shoes, man. Good boy. Yeah, these ain't no new shoes or nothing, but they also got like shit kickers. So I got some shit kickers in the truck. In the back of the truck. Good boy. Hey, good boy, Mandinka. Good boy. Hey, that's my dog. Hey, you work, son. You work. Good boy. You work it out, son. Good boy. Well, we got the double resistance. I feel it. It could probably be tighter, though. That's a little tighter. I'm running. Good boy, man. That's my dog. Good boy. Good boy, son. I don't want to touch him too much, man. I got on black. You know, with this time of year, he's shedding like a motherfucker. Good boy. Hey. There you go. You work, son. You work. You go, boy. Y'all remember Gina? You used to tell Martin that all the time. You go, boy. You go, boy. Good dog. You go, boy. Let's work, man. There you go. There you go. You know, I usually do it over the head type of joint, but I have it low enough to where they're, they're still working at, at this level. But I got this from my man. My man be working it like this. My man, uh, Poe. Grimwell Kennel. I seen him working his dog like this, and I like it. So I've been wanting to do it. Good boy. Getting that work, man. That's working that, that that front end real hard. That's giving that front end a lot of work. Then you see, I got the 50 pound. Is it 50? It might be heavier than that. 90. 90 pound resistance band. Now, I really bought that for myself. But you know, I let him use it because it works with him. That's. Good boy, there you go. There you go, son. You work it. You work it, son. And you just put that resistance on to work right there. He just put that joint to work. Good boy. That's my dog. 90 pound resistance band. And that's just a tie down strap from the hardware store. That's all that is. Good boy. Re re double resistance, man. Resistance from both ends. Come on, man. You getting that shit? Put your dick up, man. You getting that all on your dick, man. What the f Damn, should I be worried about that? Y'all ain't never had a dog get his dick all dirty. The man got his Johnson halfway out. So he got that dirt all on his Johnson, man. I, I'm thinking, should I go get a towel out the truck? Good boy. Good work.
we're in the shade, so. I don't know how these trees gonna hold up in the storm, but the wind is barely blowing. And that joint right there is swaying. This one right here, up near the top, that joint is swizzing. Look at that. That's from me hit pushing on it. Can y'all see that movement? Oh, that that's gonna come up. Man, that damn near look like concrete or tar. That's how long that path been being walked. Good dog. That's my dog. You get it, son. Get your money, son. Get that money. That's that gym talk, y'all. That's that weight room talk. Get that money, son. That's my dog. That's my dog. That's my dog. You go, boy. You go, boy. That's my dog. That's my dog. That's my dog. Mandinka. That's my dog. Good boy. That's my dog. Good boy. Now, I just had two women walk by, and they was not, uh, they was not put off by what we were doing. You know, I use the same line every time. I, you know, when random squares come around and I'm doing some work, I tell them, man, uh, like if we if we're doing this, I tell them, you know, this is tug of war without pulling my arm out of socket. That's what I always say. And then if I'm flirting them, or if I'm having them drag weights or something like that, I just tell them, man, anything to keep them from tearing my house down. This is another thing I tell them. I tell him I'm an avid Caesar Milan walker, a watcher, and that I read his book. I ain't, I don't watch him, and I haven't never read his book. I don't even know if he got a book. I think he do though. I think I've seen it before. But uh, I tell him that because you know, the one thing men do to agree on. He said a tired dog is a happy dog. He said give him something to do, man. He might be a square, but he he's, he's right about that. Give him something to do. He said that about all dogs, man. Give him something to do, man. You got an unruly dog, give him something to do. Look at him working. Look at him, Look at him working, y'all. Ooh, he's working that 90-pound tub, boy. That 90-pound resistance band made for humans. I bought that from Dick Sporting Goods. Look at my knee. That's my ninja right there. There you go, son. There you go, son. It's first time ever working it like this from this angle. There you go, son. You work. If I give him another three to five like this, right? Then I'll go and I'll put it over his head. I'm going to either put it on that tree right there or it's a, it's a basketball hoop over there. I can hang it from the hoop. Let him work on the tar, toughen his pad. I don't like that dirt on his dick, though. I'm finna go get something and wipe that off. If he let me.